Alright guys, welcome to the record-breaking part 73 of Let's Play Alundra. Right now we are finally gonna tackle with Melzess. And believe it or not, this guy is actually quite easy. Don't let the illusions fool you. I mean, he has a simple trick. The last one to materialize is the real Melzess. The others are just fakes. Just watch the glyphs very carefully, or watch Melzass himself. Either way, you're gonna nail him each and every time. Or you might fuck up once in a while, like I just demonstrated. I mean, the window of time between materializations of each illusion and the real one is pretty near. Like, it's pretty easy to fuck it up, I know. Usually when there's four, I mean when there's three, it gets a little tougher. When it's four, it suddenly just seems easier. Oops! See, once again, I fucked up. I don't know why, but it's always the ones with three that get you a little fooled up. But when there's four, like, actually more Malzasses for you to pay attention to. No! Whoa! Ah, oh, that, that one's gonna be a pain in the ass. Okay, that one I got. Come on. Oh, I got that one. I was thinking, oh my god, it's the middle, wasn't it? Okay, that time was the middle. No, 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 no! I, I think it's the uh, items in the upper left corner. It's covering my view. That must be it, I'm blaming that. Okay, how much more does he have left? He doesn't have that much, I can tell. Gotta watch carefully. Uh-oh. Ah, and I died. I just wanted for that light vessel. Okay, that's it. No more Mr. Nice Elf. I'm gonna hit you with fire magic now. There we go. You! How dare you seek to humiliate me in my own sanctuary? For your defiance, you shall drink of the bitter cup of desolation I prepared, insolent one. Alright, that's it. Final battle. This one can be a little tough if you don't have enough magic. To use the fire book. Believe me, it's an asset. Like, totally mandatory that you have this. Especially for this attack. Like, you can destroy the hands with the book with the fire book. I mean those those hands can almost kill you. I mean I know this is a cheat way, but I'm just gonna spam this magic. I don't care. And I just won the final battle. I know, I copped out, I copped out, I don't care. Thanks, Captain Merrick. You just saved my ass. How, how can this be? How can an insolent child stand before a god? Curse you, Releaser. Curse you. Without you, the mortals would have perished. Instead, I have come to this humiliating end at the hand of a mere boy. Alundra, your victory has nearly been realized. Listen carefully to the words I speak. You must burn Melzas' remains with a sacred fire to destroy him for all eternity. And with that, I'm going to use the fire wand one last time. Hey Melzas, any last regrets? Up, up too late! Arch, 
Your victory shall never be complete, Releaser! The peace you and the other mortals long for shall never be fully realized. As long as mortals harbor darkness within their hearts, evil shall exist. Oh gee, where have I heard that before? It is an incontrovertible fact that darkness resides within every mortal heart, even yours, Alundra. Uh oh. You have exceeded my expectations, Releaser. Well done! But now is not the time to revel in the sweet intoxication of victory. Now that Melzas has perished, the sanctuary cannot remain standing for long. We must escape before the walls collapse and the cr castle crumbles into the lake. Well, actually, I can just, you know, stop right here and end the video at least, and then show you the ending in the next part. How about I do that? Bye, everyone!